Alright, what's up my minions? Welcome back to another video here on the Tomaka Network channel. Welcome to City Skylines 2. Welcome to the series of City Skylines 2. Where we have not one, but two countries in one map. But there is a twist in this map, or in this series. As you can see, I removed every single road and every single railroad in the entire map because we're going to build it all by ourselves the only connection we can have at the beginning is by ship because there's a story to this whole place this see this whole thing within these rivers is the country of Arstotska. You remember that for papers please? Probably. This is the only place that has roads because this is off limits for me to build on. This whole section is off limits for me to build on because you guys will be building on this plot. I will make some regions where uh, some villages can be and you guys decide how they're going to look, what's going to be in them etc etc so for example this will be one of the towns as you can see this is how big it is and this is the place you can work with you can either send me a screenshot of how you want me to place to look and or just tell it in the comments what you want to have like what your town name must be how they must look a little bit etc etc i'll explain it all later so yeah all of the rest is the town or city or country of Artomia. Yes, I'm very creative with my name. Thank you. So this will be a calm playthrough. So don't expect anything crazy. I will be doing a lot of looking around, detailing, stuff like that. Because it will be a high detailed realistic city as well. So the story is, we have the town of our... I keep saying town. We have the country of Arstotska, or at least a part of the country of Arstotska. And we were sailing and we found this place unsettled. And we are selling our first settlement over here. However, the country of Arstotska is not really too happy with it. So they are closing their borders. So whenever we're going to connect up with the country of Arstotska, there will be needing border patrols and stuff like that. There will be needing a border. So we'll, we'll be doing toll roads, we're doing borders and stuff like that, highly detailed and of course, yeah, all kinds of stuff. So I gave myself a little bit more money as you can see and that's because we're going to have no uh, access to the outside world other than just the ship. Because the ship is about half a million, I gave myself half a million extra to compensate for that so we can always do it like that. So we have this area to play with. We have to uh, dig around. And of course, I try to do it as realistic as I can. So not to lead too many trees. I'm going to download uh, that the terraform costs money. Because it makes no sense that it's for free. So let's see what we can do. Let's grab our connection over here. That will do perfectly fine. Now we can make a connection over here. And we can actually start up our own country we're not going to build a city we're going to build a whole country how fun is that uh, let's hope it will be fun is this even connected i don't think it is so yeah i will be using a lot of mods i have like the anarchy mod and stuff like that but yeah that's just uh, also for detailing and doing awesome stuff and i will be doing a lot of looking around because this game look gorgeous <laughs> yeah everything is set to high and max and there will be some frame rate drops because this game is poorly optimized, but yeah. Uh, so I will not be building on this. You guys will be doing that. So that will be very interesting to see how that will turn out. Okay, so we have no car connection. So there's no point to having a car road. So let's start with a pedestrian road. And let's see what we can do. So we want to have like a bridge over here in the future. We cannot build it over here just yet because we still have the border yet um but yeah i try to do it as realistic as possible and that will mean that uh, if i remove trees there has to be a reason for that just not like 
I remove the whole section of trees, build uh, a whole neighborhood, and then replant those trees. There must be a reason why I delete a whole forest, like you would do it in real life. Um, but yeah, enough said. You'll you'll see as the series go on. So I think we would just do something like this. Let me see. So yeah, there will be a lot of looking around because. <sighs> You play games for for fun, for relaxation, right? Let me relax. Let me and let, uh, relax with me. Uh, I think we will do a road like this. Let me see. Something like this and connect it up over there, maybe. Get rid of that. Connect it up over there. Something like so. Is that okay? It's a little bit wonky over here though. So let's see what we can do. So let's make that a little bit smoother. There-ish. And then... That should make it a little bit smoother over there. And then go straight up. And then we can go it over here into a bridge over there. That will be fine. Gonna go down there. Next to this. We can have a, like a connection over here. Because there seems to be like an uphill thing over here. So we could do that right now. Let's see. Something like so. And then straight up. And then do something like so. For now. This will all be pedestrian paths for now. But the, there will be uh, roads of course. Um, but yeah. No need for roads right now. Because we still only have ship access. Hopefully that works actually. Haven't tried that just yet. And like so, that should be way smoother. Yeah, there we go. So we're doing a lot of terraforming. Um, yeah, for now terraforming is free. I have, haven't downloaded the mod just yet. But I will be doing that at some point. Uh, probably in between episodes. So I'm not going to do only grids. That, that's a fun name, only grids. Didn't mean, to, didn't mean it like that. But yeah, I could make a, a thing out of it. <laughs> but yeah, sometimes you have to. Uh, let me see like that. Is this still wonky? No, it just looks wonky. Alright, so we have the first connection in over here. And for now it will only be pedestrian. Turn that into here. What will So I would be thinking like, what will, what will we do in real life? Even though I'm not a city planner. Still think that would be like a nice challenge. Like what would we do? So this will be connected up here. So I think we're just going to do like something like this. And then connect it up. If that makes sense. It looks it looks a little bit wonky over here. So let's fix that up. In real life we will fix it up as well, right? So something like so. And then maybe like so. And that should be way smoother and if i want to be very sure i can just use the first person mod yeah this is workable keep pressing the wrong button okay so we need to have a connection first so let's grab this outside connection and back to there make it completely white so the ship doesn't look as weird and that should send out the first ship there's our first ship Tokyo drifting its way in. All the way white. That should make it white. Yeah, now it's completely white, so it looks doesn't look as weird. So our first ship is coming in. We don't have any houses, so I don't think they brought anyone in. Uh, that will be later. So as soon as we get like uh, more tiles, so hopefully we can get an outside connection. We can get cars into uh, the mix. First things first, we already have like a little setup over here. So we have like a small neighborhood over here, a small neighborhood over here and over here. This will be like a sort of park I think. Uh, but let's get some houses in. So let's grab a pedestrian road. And let's do a small grid stuff like this for now. So let's see if we can, can, if we can fix this thing over here. There we go. So that should be fixed. Let's grab some of the pedestrian road. So you yeah, have like a lot of mods. So I can make uh, custom uh, assets and custom stuff. 
because we will be making custom car parks and all kind of custom stuff. Alright. Let's do some more. Okay, so that should be a nice beginning. Uh, I will not be doing a total grids, but every city has a couple of grid kind of ish things. This is a little bit smoother over here. There we go. And then connect you guys up. So straight first and then bring it in nicely. All right, that should do it. So we're going to grab a couple of shops over here and then some beach assets over here. I will be using the beach assets a lot for low residential. I really hate the look of the low residential housing, but I do love the look of the beach houses. So that's why I'm going to use even inland. I'm going to use that a lot. So we're going to need some power. We don't have connection to the power grid just yet. So we still need our own. So let's place one over here for now. Should be fine. And I think... Does it need a, a road connection actually? I can't remember if this needs a road connection. Well, you see the Skylines 1 it needs, but I don't think it needs in this one. It doesn't seem to look that way. So we have some, need some water. So let's place that one over there. And we need some sewage. And that one can be all the way over there. Alright, so that should everything be sorted. And hopefully once everything is built, we should be able to get the first people in. By, uh, by ship. Could do a little bit more of expanding. So there could be more houses over here. Uh, there will be like a, a taller bridge over there. Uh, we could like already do something for preparation. Like so. Maybe you could do something like this. No, let's keep it like this. We'll change this up later. So it's a little bit better. And maybe, yeah, let's, let's already grab this. This can be like a small village. This could be like a pedestrian road. That's fine. We do need the first milestone for this thing over here. So we can actually manage this. But that's fine. And let's see. What would I do in this situation? Because I don't want to have like a huge layout over here. So let's grab it like this. Something like this. Should be fine. And connect this up. Pedestrian roads. There we go. And let's see if we can connect this up somehow. Yeah, of course. There we go. It looks wonky. Don't want it to be that wonky. I want it to be in the middle of that. So let me see if I can fix that. That looks a little bit better. I can live with that. There we go. And like so. And something like this. Alright, so we have like the shops, like uh, the information center, stuff like that. So let's grab more of the housing, some houses over here. Uh, let's see, I wish there was a way to turn off the automatic white stuff. If that makes sense. Like this, I have to turn off every time like that, but I want to turn it off automatically. So let's place two more and then some more houses. So that should be the starting village. Reminds me a little bit of the village in the Netherlands on uh, the island of Freeland. We have like a couple of more over here. So we'll start with a little village over here. So yeah, you guys will be 
suggesting towns and town names and how they look so in between episodes I will uh, add some districts where the towns can be I think there will be about 10 so the first 10 people with good town names and suggest on how the town will, will look might get into the map so we have to be paying attention there's one person in the whole town one single person couldn't you bring more like really just one only one who's the unlucky bastard where is he let me see if we can spot the unlucky bastard there's just one person okay is there more people coming nine that's a little bit better yes two people you guys are idiots you guys are absolute morons pro tip don't live in my city I'm a horrible horrible mayor yeah we will be detailing this a lot come on where are they there they are mm. let's follow him around for a little so who's the unlucky bastard yes yeah, so walk straight to the fence see if I can you got a doggy I will follow you you will be my pet so is this your pet yeah it seems like it so let's follow you're homeless really you're homeless is this your pet the Rivas family <laughs> yep so you're homeless okay there are two people living here then who are all is this only wait hold on green summers yeah there are multiple people are they just visiting or something um excuse me ma'am ma'am excuse me you <laughs> all right okay so two people even though i see more yeah i think that's uh, not the best way of connecting people up yikes so we could do a little sneaky trick to hopefully get early so let's place it and there we go <laughs> It's actually pretty, pretty mean. But yeah, let's get rid of it. This game looks gorgeous, though. Little, little puff of smoke. smoke weed every day. <laughs> okay, so we got nine tiles. Really? All right, let's see what we can do. So yeah, this is all off limits because that's the uh, the country of Ostrotska. So we want these three tiles at least. And this island, maybe. Yeah, for now, that's fine. So we can place our bridge over here and connect it up over here. So now we can actually bring a connection in. So I want a connection over here. I don't want a big bridge right now. I really like this bridge that we have over here. So how tall is that this land over here? So there is land over here. I mean, I could just bulldoze straight to the forest but in real life they would actually use this because this will cost a lot of money this will only demolish two trees so this will be like more cost effective so that's what we will do I'll try to make it as realistic as possible so this is pretty much straight I wish there were can I actually manage to do that with the move it Oh yes, I can. Oh, the move it mod. The move it mod. I wish you could actually like copy and paste. But I don't think you can do that just yet. Is this straight? Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, so demolish this for now. Mm, let me see. So I want to connect up to there. There we go. And you can connect up to there. Is this a white ray? No. There we go. So that should be manageable. Connect you up. 
let me see. And let's do something like this. There we go. And you can be connected. They will do stuff like this in real life. In the UK they even managed to just move a intersection just a couple of meters because it wasn't safe enough like why is this wonky like this let's do it like smooth let's see if that makes a difference let's see if that makes a difference Is this doable? I mean, this looks fine to me. Can I jump? No, but this is fine. So cars drive like this. All safe hiccup. But yeah, the games run smooth, 60 FPS, even at high settings. Oh, falling through the floor. I don't like this bump. So, how do I get rid of the bump? That's fine for now though, but there's a small bump over here. Oh, we'll see about that later. Let's first connect this all up. So we can go straight down here. So, something like... I want to be like... The same height as the bridge. I just don't think I can do that. It's like a little bit like so, maybe? Like so, I think. And then do something like so. Make it smooth. And then hopefully... That makes it look a little bit nice. Yeah, that's manageable. That's manageable. <sighs> Love this game. I can enjoy this game for hours. Like, literally hours. Alright. Let's grab into that. Go a little bit straight. Into there. Create some more and then follow this outline over here. And we got ourselves an outside connection. Alright. This game has something, man. This game really has something. Alright, let's get building again. And we, we could turn this into a roundabout maybe. Just a small one. think that's good so let's grab this one all right so we can actually finish up this mess so let's get rid of all the inner stuff there we go uh, you're not able to go right you're not supposed to go left you're not supposed to go right right you're not supposed to go left. So you're going left or straight. Right or straight. You can go left. Or that. So we need a way for this to go to the right. So let's do something like this. And let me see. like so let me see for example like this you could do that all the way to to there right and get rid of the we do need one over here I don't think we need one over here, don't think we need one over there. Mm, 
looks okay. Why is there a wrong shadow though? Is this a tree shadow? No idea. Okay, but it's fine. So they come in, choose left or right. You should not be able to go straight through. Nothing I can do about it because if I remove it, it only goes to the right. Okay, you can go straight or left. You can go to the right over here, so that should be fine. So we should be able to detail this up. Still don't understand why there is no residents living into the city, but that's fine. Tree there, tree there. Couple of bushes. Look at the difference how already that makes. Alright, that looks awesome. Alright, so what we're going to do, let me see. Um, we're going to detail this a little bit while we wait for more people. That already gives a different look. And I love doing things like this. Just let me know if you wanted me to do this on camera or off camera. Gotta love it already. Just a couple of streets and it already looks way different. Madison Street. So it says people are living in every building. So this is already way more than 10. It says 12, but this is already filled up. Alright, good to know. So we can expand already. We can expand the town already. So we do want to have like a ambulance station I think we're going to do it somewhere over here this will be a good spot so over here it can just go like everywhere right next to the junction which is fine grab this maybe grab an other, another connection There we go. That should be fine. And then maybe... So yeah, someone need to make a mod that disables the automatic whiteness. That would be very appreciated. Let's connect those up. And maybe one more over here. And one more over there. There we go, so we could have like a couple of houses and a little corner shop maybe. Why are you not wanting building trees? What's wrong with you? What's wrong over here? It's weird. I have no idea what's going on over here. Well, I like it. But also, I don't like it. So, let's remove that. Let's see if we can actually fix it. It was almost like a speed bump kind of thing. And then fix it up. That's fine. Alright, so we could make this into another road. So people have like two connections. Disable parking over here. With more trees. Trees is always good. I don't like the way this looks so you can build a little bit better we need a small industrial company though so let's place one over here and let's do a smaller one to, because where is the wind blowing the wind is blowing that direction so away from our Stotska and stuff like that so actually this is blowing onto the, or onto the town actually. It's not a city just yet. 
So we can do like a smaller one. Another one over there. Alright, actually looks pretty nice. Lipo Park. So we could do like one right next to each other everywhere. Something like so. And if we walk like this. Even nice. Oh, the benches even go to the side. Oh, that's nice. We have like a nice little watery stuff. People can park the cars over here. Because not every, every car park is like straight. All the safe hiccup. This is nice. This is nice. So we have like a little hanging area. Or where the trucks can uh, wait. Or stuff like that. People can park the cars. Yeah. That's, that's good. That's good. So let's grab some more trees. Trees, 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 trees. And this is where the anarchy mod comes in. And then they have like a smaller tree over there. And then some bushes. And look, some, a couple of trees. A couple of bushes really makes a difference. So we haven't unlocked parks just yet. So we have to be milestone 4. Which will take pretty much of a while. So what I want to do. Grab this. Like so. And then. Let me see. Connect that up like that. Alright. You. I want to get you to the other side. So it's, that's a four. That should be fine. Like so. Another one over here. Right to, the, to the other side. So that should be fine. So we need more people. And let me grab one over here. And let me grab a commercial building over here. Can I do like a bigger thank you? And then if I do it correctly, you guys can go like so. And maybe extend like so. That's fine. And surround you with trees. But for now, I don't want any roadside parking over here. And I can make another small little parking lot over here. As you can see, already got used. So that's pretty much awesome. And if we do park light, light pole park. A little hiccup. We could do something like this. Like one over here, one over here. 
And then maybe at the entrance, like one over here, one over there. Should be awesome. That looks good. I like that. We already have like a couple of custom parking lots that actually get used. And those are free. So that's how you can create like custom parks and stuff like that. And custom working parking lots. Really easy. Really simple. Amazing. So yeah. That's how we grab a little village. Out of nowhere. About 100 residents. That, 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 that makes sense with uh, this kind of town. Yeah, like I said, this will be slow progress. Because I love looking just enjoying and looking i don't even have a train station and stuff like that yet we just love going to ground level and just take it all in and actually live in my own built city that's uh, almost a speedboat because uh, your speed was at three atomic look at this oh i can enjoy this so much thank you guys so much for watching episode one yeah, future episodes will be like more uh, progress because yeah, the first couple of episodes you cannot do much. You have to wait for new milestones to progress. And then later on we can build this area up here. And later on where we can actually get to the border. We can actually make some border progress uh, into our Stotska, which will be amazing. Thank you guys for watching this video. See you guys next video and see you guys in hell.